why DJ has been doing it wrong. Getting up early, switching off your alarm clock, brushing your teeth, and boom! Straight into following the rigid and boring timetable. Seriously? In 2024, you're following the tactics usually used like 5 to 10 years ago. Let me take you through a perfect schedule where you get ample amount of free time and maximum utilization for the day. Let's go! Hi guys! Siddharthi, I'm your host. Avoid studying by reducing your precious amount of sleep. I've seen so many interviews where people say I sleep only 4 to 6 hours a day. That's completely wrong. I want to have a full night's sleep so that I can work all day. Imagine working for 5 hours perfectly and then bam, go to sleep. Now you must be thinking that I must take a nap in the afternoon. Sorry, this is tried and tested and I've heard from a lot of people that when they have their first sleep cycle, they tend to sleep more. So eventually, if you're sleeping for 6 hours and then in the afternoon you sleep for minimum of 4 hours, so that timetable of yours, not working. After having food, kindly, please do not study immediately. Please, after eating food, take at least 15 minutes to regain your energy. Or else, dude, you will be so uncomfortable during your study time that you will not be able to study a single word. Moreover, if you are eating something heavy, please eat it during that part of the day when you are studying inorganic chemistry. Because dude, eventually having something heavy and studying inorganic chemistry makes you go to sleep. It is very important that you give one day of the week to inorganic and organic chemistry. Please do not choose three subjects in one day. You try to do all the subjects just to finish the syllabus. When it's revision time, it will be very hard to handle. Choose either chemistry plus physics, physics plus maths or physics plus chemistry and study them properly during the whole course of the day. Late nighters, we are just not welcome in this vast jungle of ITJ. I know many people think that mornings are boring, nights are just too much fun and even adventurous as well. But disrupting your sleep cycle by studying during night, which makes your college student does not care when to wake up and when to sleep. And the worst cases of a college student to wake up is around 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Trust me, I've been that case. Kindly stop making videos based on your student life during ITJ. It is not the time to be a YouTuber. I've seen people making videos and uploading them just to try the luck on YouTube. This time should be given to your very important goal. You are being distracted from the camera and many things also even go above your head. Some people even wait to see if they go viral or not. So they glance through the YouTube studio all day. Once you enter any IIT, no one will stop you from becoming a YouTuber. Myself being a student from IIT Madras, I faced numerous problems regarding these points. And honestly, it has been a wonderful journey in IIT Madras. Yeah, I've recently completed my third year and I've learned a lot. And I definitely can say that it is definitely worth it. So grind, work hard, and achieve your dream. Wait, 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 wait. You want any motivation for ITJ? Check this video. Signing off.